Hello there once again and welcome back to our booster cracking spree and right now we are pretty much on one of the least valuable sets of the recent years. So Battle for Zendikar there's only pretty much one chase card set and those, those are the lands. So the land side from expeditions. The rest pretty much are, I think only Ulamog and this Ulamog is also reprinted re just recently in the Commander Master set. So yeah, we'll just still open it and yeah, let's hope for the best. <laughs> so, man, this knife is sharp still as ever. So I think we do have 36 boosters in here. Oh, sorry, almost forgot. So here's a code. Also, uh, it's a way long since production time, so this code won't be of any use to you, but it doesn't matter, we will still go in. So it's a pack made in Belgium from some years ago. We will have fun with opening it. So let's see. I think 1.4 is good for you. So voracious null, mist intruder. Fun thing is all these devoid cards here. Do have an out number. Channeler is a fun thing. Blooded Step is fun. Oh, nice. Green Warden of Murasa. First Mythic. And a Swamp. Swampy Swamp. And a token. Fun thing. First pack. First Mythic. You may turn target land card from your graveyard to your hand. <laughs> oh, well, that's a long time ago. Now there are rain, may, many and more cards that are way better. Demon's Grasp. Way too expensive for that. Uh, yeah, those cards are a little bit out of time right now. So there are so many and more cards that are way better to uh, to date. So, oh well, it happens like this. Ugin's Inside, didn't know that. Oh yeah, as I said, I think most of these cards are way below one euro, if even. And yeah, this set, as we have seen, the mana costs are way too high for everything that they can offer. And well, I think when the new commander, uh, not commander, but the new set from Modern Horizons 3 drops, uh, drops with um, the new six color set for the Elrazis, those may be interesting as a set. Serpentine Spike, interesting. Interesting, oh yeah. Fun little guy here. <laughs> oh well, oh boy. Right now, here's a way windy and rainy weather. Best time and date for this uh, sandstorm that's also in the water. So Sahara sand is rising. Volcanic upheaval. Good friend of, plan outburst, nice. Uh, good friend of my Zuzu deck. If you wanna play with land destruction. You have to see about your uh, pot where you're playing, whether that's accepted, whether that's allowed, whether that's good or bad. Watering elemental. Goes down. I think still the cards, the, the, the graphics from back then, those are really, really awesome. Unfortunately, the set is a little bit weak. Outnumber is a classic. Moon, Munda, Ambush Leader. If you see, it's a haste with rally for four mana. Yeah. It's really not strong, unfortunately. Yeah, it's an old, old set, but still some of the old sets were way stronger, as we know. Silent Skimmer, Heron Blade, Swarm Surge, Blighted Step is a fun thing. Lantern Scout. Yeah, unfortunately we won't find anything really of value, I think. But well, those are all sets and I just want to open them. <laughs> Spell shrivel. Yeah, today is not much of a polit talk. Ulamox the spoiler and Angelic Captain. Because still right now I'm on holiday right now, so you have to adapt, I'd say. Holiday with bad weather just means staying at home. Enjoying the time, sitting on the couch. I think you know how it is. Oh, first foil land. <laughs> Interesting. 
Scatter to the winds. Counter target spell with awaken. Interesting, interesting. Didn't even notice counter spell. But well, so inspire charge. Calastria. So natural connection. We've got a boiling earth. Bane of Balaget. Evil card. Bird monitor. Sire of stagnation. Second mythic. Looming spires as a foil. Interesting. I think the Bane of Balaget was one of the cards that was a little bit searched. Yet yeah, exiled to permanence. Uh, the, I think, even more evil version of Annihilator. <laughs> Catsail Scout, Search. Scar from Existence, way too expensive, but it works. Transgress the Mind, Crumble the Dust. Brutal Expulsion. Rather brutal one, even if it's devoid. Scar from Existence. Interesting cards. Choose one of both. Return target spell creatures to its owner's hand. Interesting. But it deals two damage to target creature. Oh yeah, exile. An exile strong set, I think. Especially for all these uh, devoid cards. Undo champion. We've got a Murasa Ranger and a Sunken Hollow. Island Swamp with control. More basic lands. Yeah, those are also not really strong. But still, you have to play with them. And I think for a draft it could be a little fun because the whole set is not really exactly strong. And it's not as complicated as, for example, Murders of Carlo Manor. I oh, thought this was a spot. Filial Club. We've got a Goblin War Paint. <laughs> fun card. <laughs> or we've Invoker. Nice. Way too expensive. Cast a spell. Interesting, this one will also be good. I've got a filler sovereign. This one just recently saw a little spike because of the cats and dogs set. So, a good little trip. So, this one was the first patch. We are on the second pillar, so package number 13 right now. And uh, so, I've got a complete disregard. <laughs> fun card, fun name. Like this. Terrible Bravo, Reckless Cohort, Vampire Rides, Old School, got a Woodland Wanderer and a Plains. This one looks nice. So, Vigilance Trample Converge. For each color of mana spent for it, fun card, but still not really strong. So, I've got a Guide. Guide us to the value, please. Seek, we've got an Expedition, Swarming Bed. Exert influence, okay, didn't know that. And this gang control target creature is last. <laughs> Fun little thing. Yeah, you can work with that. Gain control of a creature up to mana value of five with a five color deck. Cherry Meyer and Gallic Gift. Really like this card. We've got a blister spot. Transgress the mind. An endless one. This one I like. <laughs> Pay X, get X. Nothing more, nothing less. It's a completely clear card. I like it. <laughs> also, there are way m and more cards like this uh, right now. So it's not really strong, but it's a fun card, I think. And if you have your mana outlet or infinite mana or such, uh, yeah, you got a really, really big card. We've got a swamp. Interesting. Uh, no man. Swampy swamp. And a foil ally encampment. Fun card. I've got a foil rare. <laughs> and this from the set. I don't know if I'm in colors, but only to cast ally spells. Okay, well, not really strong, but it works. Dominion, Dominator's Drone. Fun card. I've got a uh, voracious null. I always think with this, uh, with these graphics, uh, it's something like. Uh, Resident Evil, it was. Fun cards. Stasis Snare, Break of Armies. Fun card, Cannabis Vista. Also likely and often played. Or semi often because of the basic lens. Uh, but it works. Man, these packs are good and easy to open once again. And there's pretty much nothing of value here. It's extreme. Nettle Drone. 
Blood Vampire. Uh, th those are too expensive for what they offer. Skitter skin, Hero of Goma Fala. Interesting. Once again, a rally card. Another ally. And this is Battlefield. Also fun. Yeah. It, okay, this works in, for example, the Shapeshifter decks and the Changeling decks. We've got a Fortified Rampart. Mortuary, Stone Fury, Retreat of Hagra. Brute Butcher. And an Expedition Envoy in Foil. Interesting, interesting. And a small, tiny step for all the Full Art lands. Back in this day, uh, they were really, really nice because there weren't many Full Art lands right now. It's a standard. So, well, it happens. We've got a Rune Processor, fun card. Goblin War Paint. Prism Array and Forest. Octopus, 8-8, eight, eight. nice. Didn't know that. So. Ooh, I didn't even know that. An opponent owns from exile into the player's graveyard. Interesting that you, uh, one of the few cards that you can uh, resurrect something from exile. Or at least get it back. <laughs> We've got a vestige of Emrakul, Throne of Slaughters, Ruinous Path, destroy target creature for three. Yeah, it's okay, it's okay. It's pretty much a murder with extra, with a small bonus. So, let's see what has the Gideon one. Evolving Wild, the Demon's Grasp. It's still too expensive, but it's also carbon for that's okay. Scar from existence, skitter skin, prism array, and a cyan at the back. The prism array against, I think, one of the Eldrazi's, but I don't know which one. Which one is this? Can't really see. Oh well, happens. Is this Ulamog? No, it's way too, way too slow, way too. Way too narrow. The Rise the Devastator, Funnel Cards, Path of Arrows, Brute Butcher, Smite the Monstrous as a foil. Oh well, a D Void. I think if the set from MH3 will come out, so the six color Eldrazi set, everything from here can get inside. Fun little cards here. Dispel, Counter Target Instant, okay. Cut like Sentinel. I think this one was uh, liked to see. Plummet, we've got a Rolling Thunder, Th Cinderglade, and the Plates. So this one was the second spot. Unfortunately, only the Bane of Balaget, I think, from the uncommons here. Maybe it's uh, worthwhile. And that's also not really much. <laughs> oh well, it happens, it happens. So, what else do we have? Bone Splinters. We've got a Salvage Drone. Interesting rune process. I really like this card somehow. Don't know why. Because those are really not strong. But well, we've got a Nissa's Renewal and a Forest. Okay, so package 25 that was. Now we have page 26. So let's see, we've got a Ghostly Sentinel. Like in the first pack, I think. Belligerent, we've got a Serene Ward. Lumbering Falls, another. Interesting. Not one of the other lands. Interesting. Not one of these basic lands. Did Battle for Zendika have a double land cycle? Interesting. Old school and time back. Hadron Blade. The Hadrons was really interesting uh, from the from a perspective of how such a game could work. Define Birdlord. Ooh, now we gain life, but Tugger Horn loses that much life. Uh, but still for 7 mana, not a really good combo piece. There are better cards for that, unfortunately. But complete disregard for this assassin. Oh well, life spring the root. So we've got a... oh nice. Void Minoar, I really like this card. And I also think one of the few cards that has value inside here, or at least a little bit. So, okay, okay, you should pull. 
got a sludge crawler. Metal drone. Ulamox nullifier. Fun little name. Oh yeah, here it is. Okay, this, the other one was Ulamok. That was Oblivion Sour. Next mythic, also nice. Target of one excels top four cards from the library, then... Oh, nice. Flint cards. Oh, well, uh, okay. <laughs> Doesn't really strongly matter, the Oblivion Sour, but it's a fun little card. Fun little thing is, uh, when you're playing Commander in a, uh, in a good round, I've had a game. A uh, friend of mine played this one after I've excelled pretty much half the uh, list half the library of uh, of another player and he got pretty much 30 lands on uh, on the uh, on his battlefield it was really fun sorry for stuttering right now i'm not really fluent so what we've got exert influence we've got an island and myrus Mellis. interesting so here's a little spot gain control target creature We've got once again a convert card. So let's see, Swarm Search. So Bone Splinters, Destroy Target Creature. I think this was also reprinted Prairie Stream, another one of the basic land cycles. So that, that'll first send the card. Not really much more packages here. Let's see and hope for the best. <laughs> Got Myra Stagnation, Kotelex Channeler, Plummet Bane of Balaget once again, Painful Truth, and a Mountain. Oh, well, put this to the side here. <laughs> Super Annihilator on, for the Bane of Balaget. So let's see Mist Intruder, Good Sandstone, Complete Disregard, Kotelex Channeler once again. From beyond, yeah, universes beyond greets itself a little bit earlier. <laughs> Still don't know the, the mechanic from universes beyond. Many people are a little bit uh, hesitant with that or rather aggressive, but still I think it's, it's pretty much okay. It's a wide world, it's a universe, where everything can happen. So it's okay, wasteland stranglers and a forest. And I know several people that only started uh, with magic once again because of the universe beyond. So goal achieved. We are getting more players and everything's fine. Eldrazi Scion. We've got an Earth. Blighted Fen. Smothering Abomination. And uh, an Oracle of Dust. Okay. And we are uh, on the last pack of... God damn it. God damn it, Gaul. So... Let's see. I didn't see the land right now, so last maybe pull. And afterwards, this box was worth nothing. <laughs> it seems much. Maya, Lion Dead, Ulamox Nullifier, Shrine of the Forsaken Gods, and not one of the expensive lands. Oh well, happens. Then let's go through with everything here. Got Shrine of the Second Gods from Beyond, Prairie Stream, Oblivion Sour, Void Venor, this is Renewal, Prism Array, Hero of Gomafada. I think this one was a fun little card. I've got the Endless one of, as a fun card. Philly the Sour Rain is a good one. The Sigh of Stagnation is an evil one if it drops. Plain Outburst, Ugin's Inside, and the Green Warden of Murasa. Ah oh well, thanks for watching and have a good time.